What's going on guys? We are back once again and we are going to be doing another movie video today and this is going to be kind of an older movie so if you guys have seen this by all means you know let me know what you think about it because I think honestly this was a great film. I think that <clears throat> it was a great just an overall great movie. Um, we're going to be talking about Darkness Falls. So it came out in 2003. You can watch it on Hulu right now. Or you can get the DVD. Uh, overall, this movie is centered around a character by the name of Kyle Walsh. Who, when he was uh, very young, he got started losing his baby teeth. So his very first baby tooth, he loses. And the whole thing in their town is when you lose a tooth, there is a tooth fairy that has a vengeful spirit that comes and gets it and if you see her she's gonna kill you so what initially happened is the character Kyle sees her when he's young he tells his mom and when this happens she ends up dying at the hands of this vengeful spirit and then Kyle is put into a mental institution for many years and he has to come back to his town after his uh, childhood crush cat calls him and tells him, hey, I need help with my brother and he's having the same thing that happened to you, possible night terrors, you know, how'd you get over it? So he comes and he starts to realize that's the same thing that he dealt with, that her brother has seen the same entity that he has saw all those years ago. And now he has to figure out a way to not only protect uh, his crush's brother, but now at the same time he has to face the thing that killed his mother several years ago and also dealing with the um, just the backlash of the town because the town thinks, oh, it's just a story, you're crazy. And that this man, you know, we, they killed his mom and that he was, you know, just, just a nut and things of that nature. So it's a pretty straightforward film. Um, I will say it's got a great soundtrack. I will say it's got good graphics for, you know, as old as it is. I think it's, I think it's a great movie. I really do. I think it's a great horror movie. You can watch over and over again. It's got a very good premises of the film. It's got a good little backstory. It's got a good story aspect. It's got good, uh, some good scary uh, jump scares um, in this as well. So this is pretty much when horror was pretty much like right, you know, right then and there. Um, I will say though, uh, of the entirety of the cast, the main one that I'm very familiar with is of course uh, Emma uh, Hotfield who played Caitlin, um, who she also played as Anya in uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer. So that's, you know, mainly what I know her from. Um, also, we have Emily Browning, who played the younger version of Kat. So, again, anyone that doesn't know her, you know, she was uh, very young when she did this film as well. And then, of course, we got uh, Chanley uh, Clay, who played uh, Kyle. So, again, we have a very interesting... Uh, just, just, just a very interesting way about the film. So, overall, I think the film is very interesting. I think the film is very good. It's actually one of my favorite horror films to this day. It's a good horror film to kind of sit back and not take too seriously. But at the same time, it's got a very good premises about it. And it's also got a very good uh, moral of it as well. You know, you could always come back and face your demons. You always got to come back and face your, your inner, you know, your past sins, so to speak. But at the same time, you know, for anyone that has not seen this film, definitely check it out. It is worth it. It is an older film, but I would definitely suggest you check it out. But overall, guys, let me know your thoughts about it down in the comments down below. If you guys are new channel, it's about subscribing. Leave a big fat like on the video if you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you as always on the very next one.